Israel unveiled the Barak tank as its newest artificial intelligence, AI, powered military advancement, promising a new era in combat capabilities. The Barak tank is very innovative, it takes our maneuvering capabilities to another level, and it is a clear expression of our technological capabilities, Israeli Minister of Defense, IMOD, Yov Gallant said of the tank, whose name translates to lightning. The fifth-generation Barak tank introduces a 360-degree awareness capability, giving a total vision of the battlefield. Israel Defense Forces, IDF, operator is able to identify targets both in front and behind his tank, thanks to a specially designed helmet that helps him filter battlefield data. The tank also seamlessly communicates the information to another nearby tank, which can immediately respond to the data and identify the target instead. Tank crews will have touchscreen devices to help them make use of unique applications with which operators will have greater familiarity as time goes on. The Barak also possesses advanced observation and night capabilities that allow tank crews to engage in close-range combat, thanks to the improved and up-to-date intelligence collection and sharing made possible by a new wide and reliable sensor infrastructure with the ability to more precisely analyze terrain. Israeli military commanders stressed the continued value of tanks in the military, with IMOD Director General. Reserves, Ayal Zamir, calling tanks the backbone of the armored corps and on ground fighting. General Oren Jiber, the head of the Defense Merkava and Armored Vehicles Directorate, said the Barak sets a very high standard of technological excellence for the IDF, thanks to a unique weapon system, the high quality technology added to it, and built in flexibility. The tank's cost remains undisclosed, but Defense News noted officials equated it to costing roughly as much as the Merkava 4M, which costs around $3.5 million, despite the technological advancements and additions to the Barak. The Barak took five years to develop, and mass production started last month. The tank's unveiling occurred some two decades after the Merkava's introduction which officials believe the Barak will replace by the end of 2025 in the 401st Brigade. Officials also plan to produce dozens of tanks each year to further update the force. In the last year, the 401st Armored Brigade dealt with the absorption and assimilation of the Barak tank into the brigade. The brigade invested in learning the capabilities of the tank against the nature of combat and its use in battle, in the training of the crew members and those in charge and in the cooperation of the tank with other advanced anti-tank weapons. The 401st Armored Brigade sees the Barak tank 